Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Skimbo. Back on BMX Streets Pipe, as you can see, we're playing in the T and the community center. Super sick area. But what I have for you guys is a new park. It's not available for download yet because as of right now I am the only tester for it. So I'm just gonna leak a little bit of footy for you. So here we go. All right. So now we got our, my moon gravity on. I'm a leak. Time to go over to this park. And now I'm gonna turn my cheat codes off. Place a marker here so if I crash, I'll be fine. So, as like I said, as of right now, I am just testing this. Just because it's not fully ready for development for it. There's some flaws with it that he's gonna get fixed whenever I whenever he fully releases it releases it. So this is just a sneak peek of what's yet to come. So as you can see, there's this little sub box, which is super sick. A little quarter pipe, which needs to be a little bit honed. And so this is, so far, I'll show you one of the problems I've already found while playing this game, while playing this map, is this handrail. This handrail, you can't really... Oh, I forgot to set a marker up there. That handrail you can't really hit yet. I mean, I've only been able to do an ice on it. I haven't been able to double peg it. I haven't been able to, to toothpick it. I haven't been able to crank arm. I haven't done any of the other gr been able to even uh, get any of the other grunts. I haven't even been able to tire ride it. And you guys know how much I like my tire rides. I do it in half of my video edits. So I'm gonna hop on my bike because that was a stupid move trying to backflip halfway up the ramp. There we go. So that's that's one of the flaws I was talking about on the quarter pipe is you do anything more if you go up higher than the lip to actually air it. Your bike tends to clip right there, which is really annoying, but something we gotta deal with. I keep forgetting to set my marker over there. So one of my favorite parts about this is the amount of insane gaps that are actually doable on this. So, like that, that you air, you can air over that big pi that big pipe, which. And I'm not going to release the name of the creator so you can be like, hey, get this done. This is one of one of my buddies from the, he's a new member of uh, the Mutant Abominations team, which I am co-owner of with Trollceratops, aka Darian, the guy that we're playing as. So, and I, he hasn't, I haven't released his edit yet. It will be out here shortly. He just needs to buy a new controller here soon. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come right here, and then so ice pick it. See, it has a weird like magnetizing thing to it. Because normally, if you're about to like hit a ledge, it's gonna magnetize. See, that's what I was talking about. That mag, that magnetiz magnetization on it, like leans you super far to the side. Like even if I tire ride it, like if I go to tire ride, that's what it does. If I go to double peg, let's see if I can. And that's what happens anytime I go for a double peg. It's really annoying. Oh, there we go. Got a smith on it. Sweet. So there's two grinds I've done on this thing now. 
but besides that, I don't have that many. There's not that many. But besides those two, there's not that many flaws. Like this is a pretty well-made park right now. And then another thing is if I is trying to get into this area of the park, like if I just ride through, I end up grinding something or just straight up eating it. So this is one of the street parts, parts of it. And obviously it's not textured yet. He's waiting until I give him the okay that the test has, that the tests are great, no problems with it whatsoever, before he fully releases it. I think he put a handrail in right there that's not fully visible. Or fully even in here. So I'm gonna put my marker there. And the only bad part about being the tester of maps is that. Because you're testing them what before they put all of this effort into texturing them and to adding materials. So you're so that's one of the bad parts is because it's not textured, everything is the same hue. But I have to say one of the shining points is definitely that quarter. That quarter is insanely fun to ride. Well, actually, this entire area is super fun. I, I should have just saw that coming. I keep forgetting to place my marker over there. Oh, I haven't even ridden that bowl yet in the, while, I was, while I've been testing it. So this mani pad right here is pretty sick. I don't know what he's gonna texture it as, but I can probably guarantee that's gonna be sick. Alright, well now I'm up in the bowl area, which oh, I already see one problem with the bowl and it's like that right angle into it. So. Try to coping stall while on it while when it's curved. Yeah. As you guys know, I'm not like Scotty Kramer with my ride. Oh sweet, fakey double bags. I haven't gotten that yet. so I can actually get speed into it. So, me, me falling right there isn't a map flaw, that is just me not being great at pipe. Well, what is this? Wait, 
Is this what I is this where I think it is? No, it's not okay. And I keep forgetting to put a marker up there. And it actually worked, I didn't impale my bike. Alright, so I just found I just found something I hadn't found while playing this map. And I've played it quite a few times. And it's that transfer into there. So now let's try to 450. Oh, that would have been sick. Yeah, so that tube that you can air over, you can also ride through as well. So that's pretty sick. Took me a while to manual through that. So here in a second I'll take you guys up to the top. But I want to get a good session in this bowl. Alright, never mind. I'll, I'll just take you guys up to the top now. So this is one thing that confuses me, like, where, what are you going to do, like, say you wall ride all the way across that gap, your escape is into this wall. <laughs> like, that's one thing that I don't understand. So, now we're going to run up to the top. Okay, that was weird too. And here's another thing that he needs to fix. That big drop that happens whenever you... So another thing that's up here is this half pipe with a raised rail in it. And I can't ride half pipes for shit because I always... I always throw the bar before my front wheel leaves. So, there's that. The half pipe works pretty well. I just ran my bike into a wall. You know, so the usual stuff. Place my marker here so I can get across this faster. Come on, can I pedal? Can I get the pedal all the way up? I cannot. <laughs> so. Now what we have is this mega, and so the trick is you just pump all the way down, but you don't row, you don't hop into it. Like you don't hop to the air. Sometimes. Because if you, now I'll show you what it looks like if you pump and hop. You're just gonna land way up here. <laughs> and again, like, sometimes it just does not work. So, I'm gonna try not to pump and only. Oh, 
can only hop so only hop still doesn't work so And you either clear it perfectly or you barely case and it launches you in a three. So I'm gonna do this one more time. See if I can actually land a three over it. Alright, I landed it, but I didn't clear it. So I haven't showed you guys one piece of it because honestly, I it would be better if you just removed it. It's not great. Getting up to it sucks. So that's not for me to show you. I'm not gonna show you guys unless he keeps that into the full version. And so there's this gap right here, which is super sick. But you have to gauge your speed perfectly. Exactly like that. Alright. So. Oh, and then there's also this, like, weird little pad. So. That's pretty much it for today's video. Later, guys.